Hi guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to play your games uh, on any browser. So if you've got Emulation Ninja installed already on a computer and you've got your games on that computer, let's say you're somewhere else, you're on a laptop and you don't want to install Emulation Ninja on the new computer or your friend's house, uh, but you've got access to a browser. So you can just log in with a browser and play all your games. I'll show you how. So you just go to the Emulation Ninja website and you use the same login as you would on your app. You go login, you log in as your user. So you can see as this user I've got a couple of computers, uh, three computers to be in fact, but I don't have any com any uh, games on this computer as you can see, but I do have some games on my Striker computer, so I'm going to switch to Striker. And you can see now there's tons of games here. I can even uh, go to the home page. You can see uh, the theme and the colors and the layout actually changes based on my settings on Striker. So it looks exactly like my computer at home, uh, except it's it's inside a browser. So let me show you how to play the games. Um, let's say, well, I've got Castlevania already hooked up here. So let's play some Castlevania online. Click on it. And it just works just like the app, except you're in, I'm in Chrome right now. So let's play the, the US version. And it's using RetroArch. So RetroArch has awesome online versions of, of, of their cores. So start the game. And that's it, that's all you gotta do. Now you got a game, I'm gonna fast forward here. I can play Castlevania inside my browser. Let me just mute it. And the very cool thing is I can actually save it so let me just move forward here. Let's say I want to save my game. I can, uh, it's going to start saving. It takes quite a bit of time, a few seconds. Uh, just the way that RetroArch works, it's, it has very large save files. I think it takes a dump of the entire uh, state of the emulator rather just than just the ROM. So I just saved my game. I can move on. I can quit, come back to it at any time and say load. When you say load, you get a menu of all your game saves. Press load, starts loading, and there you go. So that's save state, save and load from anywhere inside your browser. And the performance is quite good. Uh, as you can see, it, it works uh, quite well. And if you wanna you know, tweak it even further, you can go into RetroArch settings and whatnot, but uh, we'll keep it very simple. And it works with game pads, with keyboards and mouse, and everything else. It's a very simple, straightforward way of playing your games on, on a browser. Thanks for watching guys.